Soul of a Nameless Soldier and a Life Gem. Great, thanks. Fucking. So I read up, and there's apparently an easier way to kill the boss, and it's apparently very apparent when you get in, so I'll have to figure it out. Hopefully, if I see it. Are those crossbows? <gasps> Am I able to kill him with the crossbows? Oh, oh, there's one crossbow. Okay, that other is a wheelbarrow. Okay. Enough with the crossbows. He is fucking cool. Oh no, there's another one in the back. Oh shit, that's sick. Oh crap, this is not sick. Come on, come attack me. I fought you before. I know how to dodge you. Oh, I can run to this crossbow. Yay. Use it. Oh, I could use it. Fuck. Oh, oh no, it's broken! Oh well, my chances of ever killing- Oh no, there is the other one! Let's see if I can fucking fuck him over here. Can I do it? That is the fucking question. Use it, use it, use it. It doesn't even aim at him. Oh fuck! 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 I missed. Wow, we do fuck all damage. We do fuck all! Drink. We do no damage. What is this? How did I dodge that? That was savage. Well, my only chances of fucking uh, killing this guy one hit are zero now. Oh god, that hit always hits me. Can he jump off? That is the question. Oh my god, he hits me every single time. Use it. How did I dodge that? Oh my god, I dodged it again. Well, I missed. I think I just have to dodge at the right time, because it seems that's all I'm doing. Oh! I see his attack pattern now. That's good. Which is great, actually, that I have his attack pattern down. I don't know what that blue thing does. Oh, he's stunned! Never mind. That was a very short stun. Really short lived. I'm understanding his attack pattern. Oh, there we go. And he fucks me over. Use it! How did I dodge that again? Oh my god. I want his sword. I really want his sword. That would be sick. Finish him! Woo! Woo! First try! First try! Aha! Soul of Blade and Soul of the Pursuer. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yay. I know there's something down there. I'm actually down to get it. I remember because it's like after that you can drop down and you'll get something. Draglaic. So what? What the fuck? Oh, I'm really heavy. Holy shit. Okay, no, I'll stick, I'll, stick, I'll stick with the same shit that I had before. But what sword did I get? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Okay, well, um, so far it's been great, I guess. I don't really know. All right, another day. More recording. Um, I might merge the last video with, uh, well, not with the pursuer boss fight, with this one. <clears throat> so what I did is I bought the elite knight armor. We did level up a lot because I did take, uh, I did use the uh, soul of the pursuer because I did look up what uh, weapon it gives in this move set, and it seems like I'm not really that gonna ever use it. I don't like that type of move set and whatnot, so I'm gonna keep it on a low. I took it away. 
But I like the fa I like I think I did I, I didn't look with the the uh, I don't know what the other one is called <clears throat> the last giant's weapon does so we'll be looking at that oh shit but we did level up a lot to the point where we could take these guys on uh, we are in Hades Tower of Flame so we will be taking on this area I know there's two bosses in this area so I think we'll be taking them on today hopefully and beat them uh, if my memory serves me well that is an ss flask shard but this guy is a little bit tough but he is weaker i forgot about that there you go i do have 15 life gems which is low i'm hoping that it's not going to be like that the whole time sublime bone dust i don't remember what that does human effigy soul of a nameless soldier no what does sublime bone dust do Burn a bonfire. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's what it does. So I guess we'll go do that before we head out uh, to the other thing. I know we're going to have to keep fighting these guys over and over again. Well, I mean, that guy, I don't think he responds anymore. So we're back with this. So here we go. We're just going to burn here. Oh, okay, I can't do it at this bonfire. All right, whatever, whatever. That was a waste. Now I'm going to have to go all the way back and fight this guy again. Eh, they're not that hard. I have this beautiful ass shield, which does blocks a good deal blocks a really good deal uh okay he's dead <sighs> honestly dark souls games are my favorite games like i did I, i'm kind of over i'm kind of thinking it over like bloodborne the differences and how each game is correlates with each other and how it's better and whatnot how which which one is better and i don't i don't really know honestly bloodborne is a different take in the game there's no classes or whatever uh, and it, it makes it a little more interesting in its own way. I did look up Demon Souls to see how it was, and it is similar to Dark Souls. A little bit, of, a little bit minor differences, but uh, it is still the same somewhat. But yeah, in this case, this game is pretty cool. Um, I did also buy. I, I did also get the arrow, the bow and arrow. Whoa! What is? What is that sound? I heard some. Oh wait, what is that? Okay, because I know I, I I have played this game before, so I remember this area somewhat, and I did look up relook up my my last playthrough of this game that I did. What do I hear, people in armor? Okay, there you go. So I got this guy's attention. Hopefully I didn't alert the other two's attention. No, I just alerted one guy's attention, which is great. This guy is the guy with the big sword. Oh, I remember this. It's going to be a little bit tough. So it is me. It's me that's making that noise. It's actually... Come here. Wow, we did actually very good damage with the, the arrow. He's going to go for one more. Yeah, these guys have really low health. And now these two are going to come dashing at me, I think. Yeah, here they come. Time to run. <laughs> oh, God. I only want to fight one at a time. I can't fight two. Honestly, two is a little bit too much. Too much. <laughs> no, come on. Go away. Whoa, bros. Two is a little too much. Sorry. They're really still following me? You've got to be kidding me. I could run past them. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. If I don't get murdered. Nope. I'm going to run past them. Good. It's also good that my poise is up because now I can block very nicely. I think that's what it does. It's like, depending who has like the heavier thing, you get uh, extra... Like, you don't get knocked back all that easily because your weight is a little bit heavier i guess i don't really know but poise makes it so that your your weapons are stronger so you can uh weapons and i guess shield uh so that it makes it in uh, makes it so that you can knock somebody's shield off like when when they try and attack you or you block and it automatically stuns them but this broadsword or bastard sword or whatever it's called, yeah, it's the bastard sword. I put it to plus three, which so far is doing miracles. <sighs> Anyways, now we have a boss, I think. 
I think, I think. Yeah, Dragon Rider. Uh, these bosses are so cool. I want to see how much damage. Oh, we do pretty good damage. I just have to use the the, uh, the tactic, if I recall. You have to just stay on his back here. Yeah, it's pretty much just ride his shoulder. And you'll be fine. He's pretty slow. Just be careful stamina. Reload the stamina. I think one hits are so far good. Don't want to abuse it too much. There, I'm abusing it. It's because if ever I, I do have to hit him and yes, I have to block. That's going to be a problem. He's pretty much a straightforward boss. Really cool boss though. I think we do fight him at the end of the game as well. Like, like two of them. It's going to be a little bit tougher. But if we level up well enough, we will be fine. There, he's going to be stunned now. Yeah, he got stunned. He's an okay boss. He's pretty easy. Very easy, actually. There. He's dead. Dragon Rider, dead. Perfect. <laughs> Dragon Rider Soul. Uh, I'm not going to use this Dragon Rider Soul yet because I do want to get the weapons for these bosses. If ever the boss is... Because I think you can get his bow and arrow. Uh, well, bow, not arrow. Bow. Uh, which will make it easier, but uh, oh yeah, this check here. Come on. Are you from these parts? <laughs> My name is Lysia. I have come to spread the art of miracles, a practice of which I am a disciple. I can see that you are well suited to comprehend their wondrous power. But the cost of it, that's for your heart to decide. Buy item. Okay, so she does have cleric sacred chime. She for the ring, she has ring of prayer, increases faith, which is a lot of souls. And then she has all these. Caressing prayer, homeward. This brings you home, I presume. Lightning spear. Yeah, so these are all things. I'd heard awful rumors about this place, and I'm afraid they were all true. The king, gone. The earth, ravaged. The burden on the people weighs heavy. I fear that by now, they may have scarce room in their hearts for miracles. Why did I come here? Well... My preceptor always said this art should be shared with the world. And such is my only wish. Sometimes I fight the urge to pack up and go back home. It is... well... I must do this. And being out here all alone only makes this a more fitting test of my fortitude. I expected this cathedral to be bustling, but there's hardly a soul to be found here. Without any goings-on, I'll have to move soon, to a place I could gull them. Sorry, help the gullible by teaching the good word. I expected this could be Okay, so yeah. She is going to move, I think, to um, Majula. So at that point, that's good. Oh, wait, actually, we do have a lot of souls. I could cash them in. Um, but yeah, now we can fight the old Dragon Slayer. I think is what they call Ornstein. In, in this game, it's called Old Dragon Slayer, I think. So uh, let me just... Oh, yeah, I have to travel back to Majula to do this. It's weird because I'm, I'm kind of used to Dark Souls 1 because I am playing the new game plus the Dark Souls 1 on my own. Maybe I'll play New Game Plus 3 on rec on record, but who knows. But yeah, uh, Dragon's Old Dragon Slayer, or Dragon whatever, in this game is actually the, um, is actually Ornstein of Dark Souls 1, which is pretty cool. So I can level up three times, so I guess I'm gonna do Endurance. I'm gonna put, yeah. I'm gonna put all in endurance and one in vigor, cause I am pretty heavy and I fat roll. Yeah, you see, I fat roll, but it would be good to not fat roll at one point. Oh yeah, I actually have to go through here. All right, so we beat a first boss. We beat our first boss for today's recording. We will be going on to the next one. I'm just gonna see which one is more. Yeah, you know what? This one is actually better because it, it, less enemies to fight. 
and a little bit smarter of a path to take them out. Okay, I don't think I'm able to backstab the enemies, uh, the big enemies, which is understandable. <laughs> really understandable. Also, you could open the third area for this so that the third ledge can pop up so that you'll have more space to, to fight on, but I don't really need... Oh, actually... I don't know why he was just standing there. I mean, you could have fought, buddy. Pale stone. Okay. Oh, I actually could have burned the... The bone marrow, uh, the bone ash or whatever. I could have burned it. Whatever. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Green blossom. I hate that little ledge, man. It scares the shit out of me every time. Okay, I'm going to save my Estus. Um, this guy, on the other hand, I'm going to need a fight. Come here. Shot the wrong guy. Is he stuck in place? Oh no, he's coming. Um, oh, oh crap. How do you change? Okay, I just don't want to change to something that I'm going to regret and then fuck me over. Alright, now these two bubs are going to come. Hailstone. Fuck. Uh, one at a time, boys. One at a time. Okay, okay, okay. I was I was kind of making my way this way. Making my way downtown. No, I was kind of <laughs> making my way this way so that... Okay, yeah, because he's going to block that entrance. But I just didn't want him to uh, to come and interfere with our battle. Come here. Come here. I have a three attack pattern, sometimes four. So I can get four hits on him, no problem. And then these guys is going to... These guys are next. What the fuck was that? I will never know. I don't know what the fuck made that noise. And I hope that it's nothing bad. I really hope it's nothing bad. Oh my god. Okay. Come on. Come here. Bam. Attack! Oh, 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 I thought he was going to attack me before I attacked him. Crack blue eye orb. Well, our build is pretty good so far. I mean, we, the Bastard Sword is pretty nice. Uh, I am usually a greatsword user. So, well, in this game. So, whenever we do get it, I'll see whether or not I'm going to use it or not. But still. That was pretty, pretty, pretty savage on our part. I think there is something down here. I recall, you know, there is. I don't know what it is. Hopefully, if I don't jump off, because I think my first time I played this game, I jumped off. Divine blessing. Okay, nikes, nikes. Thanks. It's nice. Thanks, nikes. By the way, recalling, I am playing on offline mode, so it is going to be this way for, I think, the whole duration of the playthrough, because a lot of people wanted me to play offline, other than online because they wanted the challenge they wanted me to do more of a challenge than dark souls one but in this as i said i will be farming a lot more than i i did in dark souls one since i don't have as many friends so i'll be a little bit higher level than expected but because the bosses are a little bit tough in this game a little bit tougher than in dark souls one plus there's i think a little bit more bosses i don't know i don't know maybe there's the same but either way here we are i think this is a ring if i presume Old Radiant Life Gem. What's in here? I like how they just put a random chest. Oh, just random. Ring of Binding. Oh, there you go. Uh, limits HP reduction when hollow. Oh, there you go. That's sick. Okay, that's good. Um, just want to, before we enter, before we enter here, I just want to see, uh, do we have, yeah, we do have more Life Gems. Uh... I think we have enough. Life gems aren't really gonna do as much. Okay, here we go. Old Dragon Slayer. Oh, there you go, yeah, Old Dragon Slayer. Hey, buddy. Ornstein. Ornstein with gray color. Oh god, I remember this. Yeah, I remember that, I remember that, I remember that. I was watching my first playthrough, that's why.
that moment. Ornstein's alone because Smog is gone. Smog was my favorite. Also did get his armor in the New Game Plus playthrough that I did do. I'm playing on my own right now. I did get Smog's armor and honestly it's my favorite armor ever. Ever. What is it? What is that? What is that? Oh, I never saw that before. Uh, yeah, Smog's armor is my favorite and the weapon, the Smog's hammer, is really one of my favorites ever. There. Wow. Really simple boss. Only hit me twice. Uh. <laughs> oh, old Leo Ring, old Dragon Slayer Soul. Well, that was that was something. That was something. Strengthens thrust weapon counter attacks. I'm not gonna use that. I'm not really interested. My concern though is the three bosses at once type of deal that we did fight in. The, well, we haven't fought him yet, but that type of thing. I'm really afraid for that. So that's my main concern. But hopefully if we're good level enough, because we do have a lot of souls, cracked a red eye orb. If we do have if we're good enough and we have lots of souls, then it's good. I could kill this guy for his halberd. Haiti Knight, Iron Mask, and Tower Shield. I think I'm gonna use the Tower Shield. Oh, I need 30 strength. And what about the helmet? It's better than what I have, that's for sure. A little bit easier on the rolling. Transient being. This is no place for one such as you. Be gone. You are not needed. I could kill you and take your halberd, which would be nice. And you know what? I'm going to do that. You are my greatest challenge. I haven't done anything to you. This is the ultimate challenge. You're so s clunky and slow. How is this a challenge? You just suck. You're useless. Give me your Blue Knight's Halberd. Aw, yeah. I want to see how much it does. Whew. Wow, it's a D on strength, but it's fucking amazing. I think I'll put that away for now. You could test it out another time. I'm going to keep the Bastard Sword since I did level it up more than the other one. Wow. Okay, well, that was nice. Kind of wrecked his life away. And there is the bonfire here. So we will return to Majula. Hey, did I get his soul? Soul lost Ryan Dragon's like, Yeah, we did. Okay, so I'm going to keep that for his weapon. I want to keep it for their weapons. I don't know if I could get their armors, but it would be nice. I don't think I'm able to, but there we go. Anyways, who cares? So we're going to go back to Majula, and then we're going to actually have to go back and get to the Pursuer area so that we can get to the new area. So I'll probably jump cut it from there. So I'll be right back.